So today, we are reviewing a Uclear communication system that I've had for approximately a decade. So I figured we might as well do the communication system since we uh, reviewed the helmets last time with the communication system. So I bought this around 2011 is my guess. I'm not exactly sure. I bought this system from the good guys over at Extreme Kawasaki, Suzuki and Articat and Salmon Arm. 450 bucks. Com-HBC200D. And I had been using HJC chatterboxes for years and years and they were a really great big bulky piece about that wide with a big antenna and you had to when you when you would actually shoulder check and turn left when I was wearing racing leathers it would get hooked on my leathers and I couldn't turn over my left shoulder to shoulder check when I was riding. So that was a huge negative for me. I couldn't stand the size of it. They did not have the technology out yet to have them this small like they do now. I don't know if you even need those now. I'm not sure what's out, but we'll, uh, I'm sure we'll go look at some soon. But this system was an amazing upgrade from the Chatterbox because the chatterbox was only good to about 70 or 80 kilometers an hour. 80 was pushing it if it would work or not. You couldn't actually communicate because of the wind noise. It would activate your microphone. And yes, it had a little adjuster for your sensitivity on your microphone. You could adjust while you're riding it, but they just weren't up to par yet. They didn't have, have quite have all the bugs worked out. So then I bought these and it right away I noticed of course, I bought a new helmet to go with them. Right away, I noticed that we could be doing 110 kilometers an hour, a little over 60 miles an hour, and we could still communicate. Uh, sometimes I get a little out of control and get into the corners, and I can be a kilometer or two away from my wife. These things, uh, I'm going to say probably five times as far as an HJC chatterbox, we could be apart and communicating still. And that was important to me. If I can't see my wife when we're riding, I want to at least be able to communicate with her. So Uclear, spectacular. I, I'm not going to get into all the options because I actually didn't use them. You can have music and phone calls, intercom, GPS, all that kind of stuff while you're riding. I refuse. I refuse to listen to music while I'm riding, ever answer a phone while I'm riding, nor am I following a GPS. When I'm riding, I'm riding for enjoyment and to be away from all of that stuff. So that's why I can't give you the, uh, the actual rundown on all the features. And yes, you get both of them in the one kit, whereas the HJC Chatterbox, you had to buy them separately and I believe they were $250 a piece back then, so you were actually paying more to buy two. And these, uh, they were all um, rechargeable batteries on them. And they still charge to this day. I can still plug these things in 10 years later and they will charge up and I can use them. How spectacular is that? My cell phone I'm recording them with will not last as long as the batteries and this Uclear system. So thumbs up for them and the guys over at Extreme, Suzuki, Kawasaki, and Articat. Thank you so much. Now let's move on. Mm -hmm. 